Um, yeah, my name's Rob Vincent, I'm number two. I'm originally from Liverpool, England. Uh, I grew up playing there. Um, I didn't turn pro when I was 18, so I came out to go to college in Charleston, West Virginia, the University of Charleston. Um, and after I'd finished my four years there, I wanted to carry on playing, and I was lucky enough, Pittsburgh signed me. At the moment, I don't have anything concrete. Um, I'm, I'm definitely going to be staying in Pittsburgh. Um, we, my wife and I have just moved into a new apartment, so we're going to be staying around here. Hopefully find something, maybe, um, whether it be coaching with the academy or, or something along those lines. Um, it's probably a little bit of a controversial one. Um, I used to tell people it was Fabregas, just because it, it was a neutral player, but really it was Steven Gerrard. So being an Everton fan, like I say, not many Everton fans like Steven Gerrard, but I, I just liked the way he played, and that was the guy who I always watched and, and modeled my game on. No, no, no. <laughs> Um, I try and keep busy. Um, I, I enjoy doing other sports. Um, I like to travel as well, so whenever we get you know a few days off, I try and get to a different place with my with my wife. Um, but I mean, you know, nothing nothing too exciting, not an extraordinary. Yeah, my my team that I grew up supporting was Everton. Um, my dad used to take me to watch them all the time. Um, like I, I, at, at the moment, I love watching Barcelona, just the way they play, but I've always supported Evan. Ah, still, I still enjoy my cup of tea. Every morning, every night, I have a cup of tea. Um, but I'm definitely, um, I've definitely dabbled with be uh, beer and burgers, and I don't mind that either. <laughs> um, actually, just before I came out to the US, I worked um, in my my mum was working in a like a online store, like just in the offices and stuff. I did that for a few weeks to make money, and um, all that really taught me is, all that really taught me was that I didn't want to work in an office. I hated it. It was nine to five. It was horrible. I, I was just depressed all the time. <laughs> um, so that really just inspired me to carry on playing. Um, when I was in college, I worked a few like horrible little jobs, like washing dishes in the canteen and stuff like that just to try and make money but this is definitely my dream job now playing every day I, I really just like to keep everything the same if we've if I've played well or we've won the last game I try and keep everything the same um, nothing nothing too drastic but like I say if I if I wore a certain pair of socks the last game and I can remember that I played well or I, you know I try and wear those same socks again or something like that yeah, I do watch them, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not really a cars guy, to be honest. Um, but I guess growing up, the, the luxurious car that I always see, well, not always seen, but seen every now and again was a Bentley. And my dad always thought that they were like the best cars, so I'd probably say a nice Bentley or something. I guess pet peeve. Um, don't really have. I probably, probably on the field is um, is when people dive. That's probably the most annoying thing for me. Um, just I think it's I think it's a form of cheating and it's creeping it creeping its way into the game more and more now. So I kind of wish it would stop, but it's probably not gonna. My, <laughs> I'm sure she sure she'll be watching anyway. Um, I, oh, growing up, it was always Jennifer Aniston. To be honest, that was who I always looked at, and all the way through Friends, I was I would always be in awe of her. So that's probably it. Is. I think it changes day by day, but um, Marsha's got a few little small little clip, little quips. If you do if you do something wrong, Marsha'll always be in your ear. But I think overall, um, it might be Richie. <laughs> 